Good day everyone and welcome to another beautiful video on my channel. I am on a road trip in Western Australia and in this video we are going to visit another beautiful place where I went as a part of my road trip. This place is called as Albany Wind Farm located in Albany, a port city in the great southern region in the Australian state of Western Australia. It is a very beautiful place which has 18 wind turbines, each of them more than 100 meter high and there is a coastal walk and trekking trails around this place where we can go for walk and sightsee. I'm going to cover everything in this video and before we get into the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel to watch more videos like this. From the city of Albany, the wind farm is located 15 to 20 minutes away in southwest direction and on our way to the wind farm, we enjoyed the coastal beauty and the chilled weather of Albany. After a few minutes of ride, we reached the wind farm car park. As it was a holiday season, it was fairly crowded. First, I decided to go and see the lookout points from where we can see the wind turbines. There are three lookout points in that wind farm and I started walking through the entrance toward the first one. On my way, I saw some stones with some wordings. After a few minutes I started walking, I saw a notice board on my way. It was carrying details and information about the wind farm, turbines and the surroundings. It was mentioned that this wind farm never stops and operates all four seasons throughout the whole year. The wind patterns in that area were also shown and there was also a funny photo of a person showing how hard the wind can blow and push a person in that area. In that notice board, it was also shown that how the turbines and the towers were transported to that area and installed. This wind farm extends from Albany to Grasmere and there are 18 wind turbines and towers in total. The energy output from the 12 turbines in Albany region is 1800 kilowatt and 2300 kilowatt from the 6 turbines from Grasmere. It was also mentioned that the total electricity produced from this wind farm is 35.4 megawatt. If you guys are keen to know more information, you can read this notice board and know more about it. The first lookout location was not that far away. I reached there after a 15 to 20 minutes walk from that naughty spot. From the first lookout point, I could be able to see the whole wind farm and some of the bushland around it. The whole place looked beautiful, but as it was cloudy on that day, it was not showing its full beauty. The lookout points 1 and 2 were on the same side of the wind farm. After I had been to the first one, I started walking towards the second one. It was another 15 to 20 minutes walk from the first one and from that lookout point, 
you could be able to see another view of the wind turbines standing in a line along the beautiful ocean. The wind was not blowing very hard on that day and we could see some of them were rotating slowly and some of them were rotating a little bit faster. I could also be able to see several walking paths in white color among the bush at the far which are the allocated paths for the tourists to go on a walk and explore this wind farm region. As it was a cloudy day, the whole place was covered with clouds and fog and the temperature was also being cold. From the lookout point two, the next place I started walking towards was the very closest wind turbine tower. We could be able to go to the bottom of that and witness how huge it is and how it is being operated. After a few minutes of walk, I reached there and that wind turbine and the tower looked so, so tall and huge. It was mentioned that from the bottom of the tower to the top tip of the blade is 100 meter high. The lookout point 3 was very close to that wind turbine tower and I went there to have a look at the other towers at the far. It was amazing to watch how the wind energy is being used creatively and a large amount of energy is being produced. Most of the towers were rotating very slowly and some of them were stopped too. Maybe they were stopped due to maintenance works. Coastal Lookout is the last place I decided to go in that wind farm and I started walking through the bush towards the ocean. After a few minutes of walk, I reached the viewpoint facing the beautiful blue ocean. It was unfortunate that on that day, it was so cloudy that I couldn't witness the blue beauty of the ocean and the sky. But still, it was a treat for eyes. The weather was not that great in that place to enjoy the blue sky and the ocean but still it was cool and nice to walk around and spend some quality time with nature. The blue ocean and the white color forms created by the waves were looking so elegant and I also saw some rocks in the middle of the ocean. There was also a few wooden platforms and walkways installed along the coastline where public can go for walk and enjoy this place. It was very nice walking along the coastal line enjoying the view of the wind farm on the right and the beauty of the ocean on the left.
Overall, I thoroughly enjoyed my visit to that wind farm and I hope you guys enjoyed this video as well. I'm wrapping up this video here and I will see you all in another beautiful episode soon. Till then, thanks for watching and cheers.